Hey guys, Techno Mitchell with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to hard reset your iPhone 10 or in order to fix any issues you may be experiencing with your iPhone. This method is completely safe and it will not delete any of your personal data. So let's get started. So in order to do a hard reset, first thing is you need to locate the volume up and volume down button and then the big side button on your right hand side. So all you'll do is this sequence of button, which is you're going to press and release the volume up and then press and release the volume down quickly one after another and then come over to the big side button and you're going to hold that until the screen goes completely black and once you see the Apple logo appear you let go of that side button so I'm going to do volume up volume down very quickly and then hold that side button just like that the screen is going to ask you to slide to power off but you do not need to do anything just keep on holding that side button until the screen goes completely black and once you see the Apple logo appear we will let go of that side button and just like that, now it's going to shut down the phone software and then reload the code, fixing any software related issue that you may be experiencing. And if you don't get it the first time, call, try the method a few times. Sometimes it takes a few times before you get the hang of it. So press and release the volume up, press and release the volume down, and then hold that side button until the screen goes completely black. And if for some reason during this process Siri activates, that means you didn't press volume up and down quick enough. Go, so go ahead and try it again. And like I said, this method will not delete any of your personal data. Again, it's volume up, volume down, and then hold that side button. And you can do this a few times. It won't do anything with your phone besides, again, shut it down and reload the code. Also known as a force restart, if you're familiar with that. This method is safe and it's recommended by Apple as well as the number one go to steps when it comes to doing the first troubleshooting step to fix any software and even hardware related issue because it is pretty effective and you want to go ahead and try to do that and you should see increase in your performance if your phone was being sluggish, slow or whatever it was. And I hope this video was helpful. So please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks for your iPhone and other iOS devices. See you guys next time.